Hey babes, what's up? I'm in my do it for your lovers cosplay <laughs> right now. Sorry, every time I, I wear this shirt, I think about the iconic performance. <laughs> cool, today I'm gonna be reacting to another Eurovision entry. Today, hang on. Today I'm going to react to Norway. Norway. Um, Norway is sending an artist called, oh gosh, hold on. What does it mean when there's a little circle over the A? Is it Gata? 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 Good, good. Uh, I'm just not gonna try. That's the artist, and the song is called Ulveham. Ulveham. So yeah, let's have a little listen. Oh, oh that's pretty. Oh, she is a forest witch. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, this is... This might be my thing. That is so jarring. What? Oh. The melody is wowie. Oh, the whispering too. Whoa. That is a strong performance. Wow. <gasps> wow. <gasps> I'm so like taken by this. I love when a song makes me feel like there's something more in this world. I don't know. Maybe it's because I'm a little slut for escapism. But you know, uh, this was so... Oh, I loved, 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 loved the melody in this and the, the, the chord progressions they used and the, the atmosphere that we were in. Oh, and the little harmonies that they did with it were so, so satisfying to my ears. Oh, it like gave me like flutters in my tummy. That's how like powerful those felt. I got butterflies in my tummy. I love the mix of like folk music with rock and like 
I guess there's like electronic music in this as well. Like I like I like the mix of all of that really. There's a lot of bands out there that do this kind of thing, but I think they did it in such an elevated way because I, I like you know that genre of music period like as as a whole like it's just my kind of thing but this i found so elevated because of like it sounded so full there were so many layers to this that piqued my interest that like i need i want to listen to it again <laughs> like right now Ooh, ooh. Ah. and also she does a really really good job of it like she's like her whole oh, the like oh, her vocal technique just like mm, it's just perfect for this kind of, it ah uh, i like i like that and i also really like how dynamic um the other people on the stage are like when you have like the two I, I don't know if it's like a guitarist and a bass player. I'm not 100% sure. I wasn't paying attention that much to the details, but like they would like jump across the stage and like while she's like spinning around and doing a little thing, I just, I just think it's really cool. You know, what would be even cooler is if the guy playing drums and the guy playing the like, I don't know what instrument that is. Please tell me if you know, because it sounded really, really pretty. But if they also were on platforms and they were also spinning and the platforms were all going like this around each other, and like everybody was on platforms going like you know like <laughs> like the teacups in in like disneyland <laughs> i'm just saying i think that would make for a very entertaining watch uh for the audience i don't know um how difficult it would be for them to play there is i mean they're not playing live at the eurovision so it doesn't really matter right <laughs> like i want to watch them all do spinny things on um, anyways yeah, this song gives me chills, man. Oh, this is so good. I don't know. Might be one of my favorites, if not my favorite. I don't... This, wow. This has got to be my top three at least. Gosh, wow. <gasps> like this, this is the type of song that like transports me into a different world. And like, I'm like, I'm there. I'm there. <laughs> I'm not here anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Man, oh, this makes me so excited for Eurovision. I'm so excited. Cool. So those are my thoughts on Norway's Eurovision entry for this year. Uh, please let me know how to pronounce the group name. Also, if, like, if you uh, know what the song is about, I would love to know what the song is about. Please, please tell me if you know. That would be very, very kind. If you like the video, leave it a like. And if you want to see more Eurovision content from me, then feel free to subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye! That'll do, King!